this video, I'm going to highlight the differences and similarities between Linux and Windows. I hope to cover more details about systems in future videos, so stay tuned for that. Firstly, to avoid confusion, I should state that Linux is just the kernel, or core, of an operating system. Well, what is a kernel? Well, a kernel is a program that starts early in the boot process and handles requests from programmers to communicate with the hardware and to launch other programs. Windows has a kernel as well, but the name also refers to the whole operating system, including the programs and files that are included in a standard installation. Linux is usually offered in a distribution, namely Ubuntu, which is a collection of software packaged with the kernel. Many distributions are called GNU slash Linux because it contains free software released by the Free Software Foundation, provided with a GNU license. Most Linux systems have GNU software, with the exception of Android. From now on in this video, I will be comparing Windows 10 with Ubuntu, for the sake of simplicity. The main difference between a Linux distribution and Windows is that in Windows, graphical features are baked into the system, whereas in a Linux distribution, you can switch between a text or graphical interface. In a GNU Linux distribution, you are free to change or install new software and do without a graphical interface if you want to. Windows 10, like the versions which preceded it, were exclusively developed within Microsoft, and each version has been part of the same product line. This is the reason why lots of programs are backwards compatible because a lot of the APIs or functions that programmers use are still present in modern versions of Windows. This backwards compatibility is not guaranteed for a GNU Linux distribution, however, and so the software has to be maintained and recompiled at times. Ubuntu is a Debian-based distribution that uses the same package management tool and system to allow users to install compatible packages for the system they're using. It's commonly these days to see programs that target specific releases of Ubuntu, such as 2004. And it's also common to see users providing their own repositories to provide more up-to-date versions of software. The main similarities between Windows and Ubuntu is that they run on the same hardware or the same processor. This is an important aspect of an operating system. It abstracts away the details of the hardware so that programmers can focus on reusing certain features. The main differences between Windows and GNU slash Linux, such as a distribution like Ubuntu, is that Windows is proprietary and closed source, and is less customizable than GNU Linux.